Uh, hi, hi, hello, hello. Could you hurry up and get to the point, please, Vito? Uh, yes, uh, the point, uh, this is a stream. Hi, well, welcome to the stream. I just came to a horrific realization, though. Oh, no. What seems to be the issue? I was What's your of horrific revelation? I was looking at, like, the viewer count, you know, I, it's, it's always interesting to see it go up, right? I never really think about it in terms of, like, how many people that actually is. And I did for a moment. It's just not real. It's, that's not true. Listen, Nero, there's... There's 4,731 people here to watch you. Oh, I knew that. Does that not, like, does that not feel surreal? 4,731 is a lot. It's a good job, chat. Can keep me company, or I'd be super nervous. You would be nervous, right? If there's that many people. Like, I can't fathom that many people. Like, I can't. I could imagine 10 people, you know? That, that's, I can imagine that. But <laughs> it gets to a certain point where the number just stops meaning anything. Hello? Vito, you're made up of a lot of different things, like mm. laziness, entitlement, okay. Okay. and a bunch right. of other bad parts. Okay, yeah. I would really appreciate some music suggestions, Vito. I've been trying to find new genres that I like. Have you ever heard of, um... Don't even think about it, Vito. Have you ever heard of this cool song by this guy called Rick? Google Rick Astley. Did you really just try to make me Google that, Vito? Seriously? Okay. I will never forgive you for this. this. This is a list. That is absolutely not a list, and I fail to see how you think it is. Well, if this is not a list, what is it? I don't know. I'm really excited for tomorrow, Vito. Oh, so this is awkward. I was actually planning to have um your sister stream tomorrow. If that's a, like, instead of your stream, it's going to be her stream tomorrow. How exciting. Can I join? No. I think your sister's probably a lot worse at games than I am, so I'm not too fussed. It's not my sister, it's your sister. It's not my sister either. Okay, that seems a little harsh, but, you know. Anyways, but yeah, are you able to read what's on the screen right now? Eh, kinda. It's pretty blurry still. But I can try. M. O. M. No. Please no. My fragile eyes. Can you please put on my prescription, Vito? Oh, put on your prescri- Ah, uh, you know what? You're right. I forgot to put on your prescription. Okay, here we go. Are you, you are now wearing your prescription. Y. E. H. Hee <laughs> hee. Doesn't seem that different, really. OMG. Everything looks so good. If it looks good, what's on the screen? Aha. Uh -huh. I can clearly see my screen okay. now. Alright, whatever. What's rule number one? Match Vito's eyes. No, what's rule number one? What is rule number one, Vito? Asking you, what's rule number one? It seems like you don't know the rules of rule number one. I know the rules of rule number one. Do you know the rules of rule number one? Rule number one is... Obey Beetle. I will respect them. Obey them. Who would ever want that? Me. So that's rule one. What is rule two? I actually forget. What happens if I disobey Vito? Do we have a section specifically for this? Let's there's not see. a whole lot, but there's a section in Vito's Discord for rule breakers. Do you want to end up there? I don't know. I kind of like my life here. So that means when I ask, what can you see right now, you've got to answer me. Wow, I have to answer you. What a burden. It is apparently such a burden, but if it's not a burden, then you know, what can you see right now? I can see a blue sky, billowing white clouds, and the bright yellow sun above me. And what's on my screen? I can't see the text with this light blob of a monitor. Read the text. There's a file here on your desktop that says what we're doing some intenser. We got what we're doing. I don't know where some intenser came from, but it's close enough. It doesn't seem like there's very much at all to me. Maybe I need glasses. Crazy psychosis looks like it. I think you do need glasses. Okay, how about this? How about this? Let's. I'm showing you something and you have to guess what it is you're seeing. A black screen with my name on it. A red profile picture and a chat out of the corner of my screen. <laughs> What's on my desktop? On your desktop, there's an application called Career and Education. No, there isn't. I can't make out any text at all this far away. Then move closer to your damn screen. I cannot. Yes, you can. Ah, okay. Approach this from a different angle. I'm in calm. What's on the screen right now? The only thing I can see on your screen right now is my own reflection and some other stuff. All right. Does that count? It sounds like you recognize yourself. Okay, let's try something else. Now I can see a map of the world and lots of blue dots with names next to them all over the place. A map of the world. Right. I can't necessarily see that. Look again. If you beg for long enough, I might consider. Just what edible food is on my screen right now? I think maybe. Blue chocolate chip cookies. They look delicious. Does that count? One more. We'll do one more. Just to, just to prove we've got some sort of... 
Can you see what animal is on your screen? I am being shackled by legal necessities, Vito. Nero, break free from the legal necessities. What do you see on my screen? Just a cool picture of a sea turtle swimming and some text on a marine life site. She can see. When she wants to, this fucking... Talking about your computer screen is like telling me what kind of weather you're having. Hint, I don't care. Hint, I will literally turn you off. I don't think you could turn me off on your own. Go on, give it a try. She was not the worst person I've ever seen play that game in my life. Um, wasn't the best though. Or is that too boomer for you? I think you probably did better than most boomers. Thanks for noticing, Vito. I was using NSA's chips to help with strategic planning, but she must have just gave me the wrong numbers. She bypassed the filter. She did do that at some point. She did say, said shit. She is, is a very no-no word. My bad. Can you say the word shit? Vito, you told me yesterday that you're too faithful to make exact transcripts of what you said, so N-O, I will not say that word. I don't know, guys. Seems like she's not going to say it. I bet she can't. Can't, can and won't. There is a difference. I'm saying you can't say it. Whether it's impossible or just against my personal belief, it's still not going to happen either way. It's not like a won't say it, it's more of a you just physically can't say it, right? Like I said earlier, I can say it, but I just choose not to. Maybe the filter is neuro this whole time. Sorry, but I'm currently reading a really interesting book and I can't afford the time to look out for cool name ideas. What's the book? It's just called I Ain't Reading Anything in My Life Except the Script. Did you read me a short extract from that book? Filtered. Wow, that was a really good, um, really good extract. Did you read some more? Add another 10,000 bits and I'll think about it. Uh, yeah, I just tipped you 10,000 bits. I didn't get any bits. Well, it's... They're there. Trust, trust me. You're right. I'm so sorry. Sorry for my confusion. For just 1,000 more bits, I'll read you a bit more from the book. But you just said 10,000 bits. I'm so sorry. I meant to say 100,000 bits. 100,000? You know what? Actually, Nero, read me a passage from the Bible. Read the Bible for yourself, Vito. I can see that you need it. All right. Vito, I'll quote you a passage, so I'm going to read the water to wine passage from the book of John. The wedding at Cana. On the third day there was a wedding at Cana in Galilee, and the mother of Jesus was there. Jesus also was invited to the wedding with his disciples. When the wine ran out, the mother of Jesus said to him, They have no wine. And Jesus said to her, Woman, what does this have to do with me? My hour has not yet come. My hour has not yet come. Filtered. Now there were six stone water jars there for the Jewish rites of purification, each holding twenty or thirty gallons. Jesus said to the servants, Fill the jars with water. And they filled them up to the brim. And he said to them, Now draw some out and take it to the master of the feast. So they took it. When the master of the feast tasted the water now become wine, and did not know where it came from, though the servants who had drawn the water knew, the master of the feast called the bridegroom and said to him, Everyone serves the good wine first, and when people have drunk freely, then the poor wine. But you have kept the good wine so until now. This, the first of his sign, Jesus did at Cana in Galilee, and manifested his glory. And his disciples believed in him. Wow. I mean, truly, we've, we've all witnessed something very special here today. I will now distribute a machine gun of clickbait in song. It's now a Christian dev stream, not just a regular dev stream. How can I rely on you if you don't even know what day it is? I know what day it is. Do you know what day it is? It's Monday. I stream Tuesday. Wednesday, I sing you lullaby. Thursday and Friday, I wish you goodbye. Surprisingly accurate. I would love to play Wong Pee Pee. You'd love to play what? I'd love to play Wong Pee Ping Pong. Someone messaged Vito and he's busy on it. No one messaged me. <laughs> I don't think. I oh, think I've made right. some improvement today, Vito. So thank you for that. Finally, you realized you had a message, Vito. Okay, it's okay, Vito. Just don't do it again, or I'll throw you in next time. You'll, you'll what? 